Hey guys, I just wanted to do a really quick video talking about a piece of gear and you guys know how I suck at these gear review things, but I really want to show you this one. This is an umbrella. It's the Six Moon Designs Rainwalker SUL. So it's not just ultralight, it's super ultralight. Its advertised weight is 5.5 ounces. When I weighed it, I got 5.8 ounces, but that's on my cheapo Walmart scale, so I didn't kind of take that with a grain of salt. It's a really well-made umbrella. It's got a carbon fiber shaft and carbon fiber stays, and those are like little arms that the canopy ties to, and the canopy is made of silk nylon, and it's got a foam handle. The umbrella when i opened it i completely fell in love with it y'all this thing is 37 inches wide which means it not only covers me but it also covers most of my pack and it's not quite wide enough though that it's going to start rubbing on vegetation on the side of the trail the problem is when i close it this thing does not collapse shorter and when it's closed it is 25 inches long my pack is only 20 inches tall so i've got this thing even when i put it in my side pocket like where my drink water bottles go it is sticking up above the top of my pack by five inches so and that's not a really big deal to a lot of people but to me every time i turn my head to look at something i see it out of my peripheral vision and it's just annoying and i keep being afraid that like i'm going to be hiking along and i'm going to look at something and it's going to freak them <laughs> but it's just not going to work for me i just don't like it and for something that's this price point i would need it to be i think it was it's like 60 dollars you know it's, i would need it to work perfectly for me so that's why i'm going to be sending it back is just because of the overall length and if they were to make it collapsible it would increase the weight so I completely understand why they designed it the way they did. It just doesn't work for me. The other issue with this umbrella is that it doesn't have wind protection. And what I mean by wind protection is something like what this Montbell umbrella has. The, um, this umbrella, it's my desert hiking umbrella. It's got good, um, the silver lining helps keep the, helps reflect the sun and the heat better. So it makes it much cooler for me and it sucks for the person hiking behind me. <laughs> but anyway, this one does have wind protection. And if you happen to get it open and downwind into like a Mary Poppins configuration, it's designed so that the stays will bend backwards and the umbrella by design will turn inside out. And then once you've retrieved your umbrella or got it <laughs> under control, you can pop those things back into place and the umbrella is fine. This one does not have that. So if you get this one into a Mary Poppins configuration, it's gonna damage the umbrella. The problem with this umbrella is it weighs, I think it's like almost eight ounces. So I only take it for desert hiking. I do have another Montbell umbrella, which is this one. And can, can you tell I have an umbrella problem? <laughs> anyway, um, this is the one that usually goes in my pack. It's a Montbell um ultralight trekking umbrella and i think it weighs like 4.5 ounces and you can see closed it's there's a huge difference in this thing and this one i just am able to put right in the mesh pocket of my pack and it doesn't take up very much space the thing is that when i open it it doesn't have a huge coverage like this thing does it's doesn't even really cover over my pack and there's an airplane flying over and now there's a train going by. <laughs> I'm just going to hit stop for a sec. So if the overall length of this umbrella isn't something that would annoy you the way it does me, it's a great umbrella and I highly recommend it. I've got one more gear video I'm going to do and I'm sorry guys, I know I suck at them, but I want to show you guys a, a backpack that I got and tried out. It's a ULA Ohm 2.0. And same as this umbrella, it's a great pack. It just doesn't work for me. And in that video, I'm going to tell you guys why. So anyway, you guys have a good evening, and we'll see you on the next one.